Hello everybody, it's Zach here again, and I just want to make a quick video about this because um, it's actually super awesome. Um, right now at Walmart, they're doing some XL Energy Savings um, program with with light bulbs and stuff like that. So if you were to go there and get the great value curly cues, these were 96 cents. That's right, 96 cents for four bulbs. That's like unheard. When I seen it I was like what? And I had to go scan it and stuff like that because normally bulbs a four pack is like five or six bucks. So I bought four boxes. I know it's bad. <laughs> but no, um I would go and actually save up for these. Um there are the they have a few different kinds, I believe that have the energy savings, but these ones are the sixty watts, but they actually are fourteen which makes them good and they're kind of like a duller color like a orange color I haven't had normal you can see it up there but I haven't had like light bulbs like that we have the daylight curly Q ones but I just had one bird on the kitchen last night so um... <clears throat> it says on here uses you know only fourteen watts um, and it would cost you a dollar sixty nine a year if you um, had them on for three hours per day. Although I don't really know because, <clears throat> with that being said, we have a uh, one, two, three, six, nine, ten, eleven bulbs, like twelve bulbs in this house, and it runs us like forty dollars a month. And we probably don't have them on for, well, maybe the bedroom ones. Well, that's, that might, uh, it has to be true. I mean, they know their stuff. I'm just saying. <coughs> 900 lumens. Yeah, so I just want to let you guys know that I might be picking up another box or two just because it's handy. Your estimated life is nine years. But um, I want to talk to you guys about biking how that's going. Um, I, I have been biking all around town. I've only biked to school the one time. Fact being, uh, I biked to school the first day and then the day after that I had to go to work. Uh, the day, that would have been um, Tuesday I biked, Wednesday I had work. Thursday I could have biked, but we had really strong winds that day. Um, really strong. And I needed to get a new shifter for my bike for my rear cassette sprocket thing and so uh, I, I was only in one gear and it was the hardest gear on the back you know the smallest little one so um, <clears throat> instead of uh, struggling again it was like it was like windy like 30 mile an hour winds so instead of struggling it I just drove my car also because there was um, a chance of rain as well I think like 40 or 50 percent chance and the skies were pretty gloomy out so I was like I don't want to chance that but uh, I did a calculation for driving to uh, <coughs> for driving to school on my bike and it said online that it would save me like three dollars and eighty two cents a day and I think why it's so much higher than what I figured is because they fit, they count in like your wear and tear on your car. But if that is the case, that makes it even more worth it to ride my bike to school. Um, where am I going? Where am I going? Anyways, yeah. So then yesterday I went to the local Gopher Bargain Center, which is like a, it is like the coolest store. Um, it's just like one of those little like family-owned joints, but they have everything you could possibly think of for like really good prices, like furniture, food, everything. Anyways, um, <clears throat> so I went there and I got one of those Shimano. Um, everything on the bike is Shimano, so I was able to get a Shimano seven-speed for ten bucks. <coughs> and now she's ready to go. I don't even um, have one for the front at all because I don't. I don't need one. Um, I never in my life have really used any of those bigger gears. I always just use, you know, one through seven with the smaller one on the front. And uh seems to be working fine. I don't think I'll ever even put it on there. 
Um, I do need a front brake, <clears throat> but I told my girlfriend that, you know, um, I wouldn't spend any more <coughs> money on my bike until I actually rode it enough, you know. Like at a dollar seventy five if I need a front brake and it's ten bucks, then I'll have to ride it about ten days before I can buy that, because then I know, you know, okay, I've rode it quite a bit, whatever. Um, so that's that, but <clears throat> the thing gets awesome gas mileage. I mean, it's, you know, freaking 100 miles to the gallon of water. <laughs> <clears throat> but yeah, I rode it all over yesterday. The thing's just fun. It's fun to have a bike. Um, it gives you something else to do. I'll probably ride it quite a bit. Oh yeah, and the tires are pretty cracked on it, but until they go, I'm just going to keep riding that thing. Mm. And I feel good. I think I've lost some weight by biking. Um, you know, when I rode to school and back, I figured it out on one of those calorie calculators. I burned like 900 calories, and that's way more than I would ever burn at the gym. I think the most I ever burned at the gym was like four or 500. So, to do that and be for a good cause for saving gas and everything like that, well... <clears throat> Why not? You know, personal health and everything. But uh, I love that thing. It's awesome. And then the front steering wheel, or the front, not handlebars, but the actual thing that goes into the body of the bike, gooseneck or whatever. It's like loose in there. I don't know if it takes bearings. It must, but it's loose in there. So I tried to take it off, but I can't. So it's probably gonna be something that like I'll have to bring into a bike shop, but when I'm riding on it, it doesn't affect how the bike rides at all, so um, I'm not really going to worry about it. Hmm. I'm trying to think of anything else. Today it looks like it's going to rain out, and it got really cold. Like, it's like 20 degrees out there, it feels like. Better not snow today. Yeah, like last night, it was really awesome, you know, it was 50s all day long, and now today it's probably at 20, 30 degrees out there, <clears throat> probably closer to 20, it's like really cold, so, I guess I won't be going on many bike rides today, alright, I gotta go, my coffee's done, <laughs> oh, shoot, I'm not supposed to be drinking coffee, well, I made a little bit of an exception, I'm drinking some coffee, but I'm still not drinking pop. I drink a lot of water too, and I don't make a full pot of coffee, I just make like one or two cups. <coughs> More so. Okay, goodbye.